often coho will lay on the soft edges like you see over there on the next to the bank they'll lay in those soft edges uh deep soft edges where steelhead will lay in more even flow uh coho like the soft edges with hardly any flow next to the current and a steelhead swing you just cast out men let your spoon come out come across without doing much to it a coho when you throw for example I let it sink on that edge, and it sink, 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 sink. It's dropping and sinking. I often get bent on the drop. I just kind of twitch it up and down like that and let it drop. A little bit of slack, I'll reel a bit, drop a little slack into it, let it drop back down. Salmon love anything that falls and wiggles, and that's uh, probably catch them jigging. They love that thing on the fall. Same with a spoon. The difference being is that thing is animated and flashing. That is the di only difference. But yeah, you fish these. Although you can catch them on the swing like I'm doing right now. Coho will eat it on the dead swing, but they do like it on the drop no matter where they're laying. For steelhead and coho, I keep my spoon finishes the exact same. It all depends upon water conditions. If, if it's high with a lot of color in the water, two to three feet, I'm going to go silver gold plate every time. And clouds. If I get water like this where we have six feet of visibility, Brass is good. Brass and copper are very good. They less uh, only 60% flash instead of 90% flash. So yeah, you want to tone it down a little bit. You want to excite them, but you don't want to scare them. You want to keep on that attraction threshold of jazzing them up, but not so much that they go bombing out of the pool. If I'm going to hook a fish, it's going to be in the first. 10 seconds. I'm already in water. I'm already out of the water. They'd be laying in. They'd be laying right in front of me. The steelhead might lay right in front of me here. Coho, they like to follow the deep water. They're a different creature. I'm going to make one more cast here and I'm done. I'm losing my edge over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see you. <laughs> one more Drop, drop, drop. Wobble, wobble, wobble. We're gonna get bit right now. Right now. Is there a little slack like that? I can drop. Let's give it a, just a hair of slack. And let it slide back and drop. You can see my line is just flying all over the place. That spoon is just jumping and winging. Just, when you pull on it, it'll just spin in one spot when you let it go and bounce like that it'll just whip back and forth and drop and wobble and that's what drives the coho insane hmm okay nobody home we in the boat